the red truck that you see right behind me is my truck and to explain how i got there my car simply got towed um so as i was heading down my apartment complex like down the stairs to go to practice i realized that my car or truck was not there at all you know i honked my horn and everything no sounds nothing at all i figured it was towed tough day today was supposed to meet with the team to run can't do it i have to wait for the towing people to get here i guess it's gonna take about an hour um with that being said i still have to run do all the stuff a collegiate athlete does as a runner so you have to remember to stay calm i guess it's a great learning lesson um obviously it got towed for a reason i accidentally parked in a reserve spot <laughs> they'll they'll get on to you pretty quick especially uh, parking enforcement at the university back to what i was saying in this these situations mainly you have to realize how to stay calm and roll with the punches it's just life you know and then it also goes hand in hand with running so you have some setbacks feeling fatigued if you're feeling injured you just got to realize things m may happen but you will be fine in the end just gonna wait here for a while and listen to music stretch and then hopefully run soon i also wanted to give a shout out to christian my roommate and my teammate uh he gave me a mat roll out and drove me here so that i can just like chill and stretch and wait let me just prove this is my yep that's mine <laughs> I just got it back and I'm gonna have to try to squeeze in a run and try to eat breakfast too. Yeah. <laughs> hey, get your numbers up. I had to get my numbers. I'm gonna show my kids this. Oh my god. The biggest track and field fan in the world. Oh, good job. Got Yaka? Bro, of course. Dude, this is gonna go two ways. Or one way, really, but. I'll accept the Nagoose win, but God knows Jakob should win this race. Oh, the Norway boys to the back. Dang, they're going out fast. Yep. At least I know I could have paced this run. No, you wouldn't have been able to. I, I think I could. Uh oh, Lauros is making his move. The 18 year old. Uh oh. No way, Jasper wins. It's not, it's not happening. Jakob got it. Jakob got it. Jakob got it. Oh. And the Norway dude's gonna. Kerr just won the world championship. I really love how he was aggressive. He went for it, and Kerr was there. He's always there, but he normally gets dropped that last 200 or around there. I was and he surprised. Came later today. I'm surprised he lost by. And he didn't lose by that much. He lost by. Yeah. I'm surprised he Ooh. lost so convincingly. Yeah. He just like gave up. Hey, that's it. Yes, and he's so mad. That's two years in a row. <laughs> Glad it wasn't like some God, random. Don't even lie. He just didn't he have. He just to. fell short. He, that last like little bit, like that kick he had in the semis the other day. I uh, thought he was. I thought he was gonna pull that out. <laughs> it was nowhere to be found. Yeah, yeah, not today. I wonder why. <sighs> Got our chef here. Eli McWilliams. How you doing? Pasta was very good, so. Thank you. You know, Chef Mac do what he can to, you know, stay alive. And that means cooking sometimes. Todd, you passing the time trial tomorrow? Oh, yeah. With ease? With ease. Perfect. That's what I like to hear. So, um, if I go to bed now, probably should be able to go to sleep by 10. 
and then wake up at six. That'd be a good eight hours. I'll get ready for tomorrow and I'm excited. So. <laughs> Fight, how you feel about the fitness test? 10 seconds fast. I did it this year. Still did it last year, but this year. This it, year it doesn't matter. 10 now, seconds fast. Now you're like officially passed. So. I did. Let's go. How you feel about the fitness test? I know you passed. It was easy. No sweat. Yeah, you are pacing for like four miles, so. Yeah, first four. Pretty calm, right? It was easy. But this season? On to the next day. Yep. I also passed, I think it was like 32.30 or 32.31, so pretty solid, didn't feel too hard, um, but it was just 6 mile, 5.30 pace, so. Nice, I got that on camera. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, so Mario, Mario was talking all that smack, and I dropped him today. Me alone. Me and Gadisa dropped Mario Ruiz. We don't start calling bro Luigi now, but we dropped him, and he's done for. Mario, do you have any words? Yeah, how we, how I dropped you? You did not drop me. Type shit. It's about us right now, bro. Where you going? It's about us right now, bro. Where you going? I'm with you. Yeah, he be doing drugs. Hey, G. It's about us right now, girl. Where you going? It's about us right now, girl. Where you going? I'm with you. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's about us right now, girl. Where you going? It's about us right now, girl. Where you going? It's over. You really look up to Jakob Inga Brixton. I know, not to get out Exactly. It's, like, it's funny, it's funny because like, I was in the lead at first, then he came back, then I had I had a chance, then he out kicked me in. <laughs> <laughs> that too, like, that was horrible.
gotta be over 70 calories at least. Come on now. 115. I'll take that. I'll take that. Even better than I was yeah. last time, baby. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We back. I'm good. Ooh, ooh. I'm good. Even better than I was last time, baby. Ooh, 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 ooh. We back, and 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 we back.